Hi, yes, today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak an iPhone 3GS with Pwnage tool. Okay, so first of all, have your device plugged in, and you can either, it works for iPod Touch 2nd Gen non-MC model, and iPhone 3G and 3GS. So, here, let me start. You can either do simple mode or expert mode. I recommend doing expert mode. You click that and it's browsing for IPSW. So you could download I'll have the link in the description where to download the IPSW for 4.0. So browser. So browse for IPSW. I'll pause it so when it's lo done loading. Okay, so now that's popped up, you go to s wherever you have your IPSW loaded. For me, it's right here. So I open it. For me, it was on my desktop. Yours will probably be in downloads. I'll come back when this is done loading. Okay, so it's done when you have general city of packages so click general then this if you're on a 2g or an iphone 3g you could click that so but that's enabled for me and activate phone enable enable baseband update my baseband's already updated so there's no point in clicking that and then root partition i would not mess with this at all unless you know what you're doing because so 831 megabytes is good for me. So then you have packets, select packages, download the package, manage sources. I just would leave that. You could add them later. Then you have Cydia installer. The whole point of jailbreaking is to have Cydia. So click next. It you you're more than welcome to try and figure this out and have a recovery logo and a boot logo and change it. But if not, I'll link you to someone and that knows how to do it in the video. But I'm just going to leave them the way they are. Then you click build. Then it should build the IPSW. So it's oh, so first you save that to your desktop, your custom restore. And I'm going to say replace because I'm making a video. And I'll come back after this is done loading. And then show you what to do. Okay, so when it's almost done. This will come up and say enter your password. So I'll enter my password. Then it should be done in a little bit after you enter the password. So that's what it should be doing. So I'll pause it again. Okay, so it's done. It says choose your punish application and cover in iTunes. It says that. Oh, my friend's typing. Then you have to put it in DFU mode. So it's connected. Turn it off real quick. Slide to power off. Okay, so then after it's off, um, you hold the power and the home button for 10 seconds. See, it's failed. Hold on. So you hold the power and the home button for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, then you hold the power button, or some shit, or some shit like that, so it should work, but I'm not going to put mine in DFU mode, because I don't feel like it, should be in DFU mode, oh, it's in recovery mode, my bad, same concept though, okay, so I have to turn off my device, so yeah, you get the idea, put it in DFU mode, and you should be able to be jailbroken. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. A peace.